cost of university. The cost of a university degree in Canada is getting steeper, with tuition and other compulsory fees expected to have about tripled from 1990 to 2017. The price tag for a university degree is very costly. When additional cost is included with the tuition, the cost of a four-year education estimated to reach over $80,000. With these drastic costs, students are leaving the university in high amounts of debt. Statistics Canada estimates students with both public and private debt end up owing on average of $37,000 by the time they graduate. This is an increase of $8,000 from just 20 years ago. It is interesting that a student goes to university with the ultimate goal of getting a good job and to make money, but the majority of them leave the university in severe debt. In February, the federal government announced it is writing off another $231 million in unpaid student loans from 2013. Repaying these liabilities is becoming more of an issue for students on average that take 14 years to pay back. To make matters worse, Ontario's PC government has dropped tuition costs by 10%, eliminating free tuition for low-income families making it more difficult to qualify for OSAP. And terminating the six-month interest-free period after graduating meaning students have to pay interest on their loans as soon as they get out of school. Students aren't very pleased about this. The Carleton University Student Union has been advocating for student cuts for some time, but say the changes to OSAP to turn good news into bad. Also, at Ottawa, students say that they are happy to hear about the tuition drop, but worry about changes to loans and grants that could leave them struggling to pay off debt. If these costly university rates do not get more attention, it could cause a downward spiral to several Canadians' well-being. Though success in the workforce, it usually requires post-secondary education. The ability to pay for, the, for this has become difficult for many. This will make it difficult for less fortunate to attend school and to obtain jobs that they want. On top of that, rising costs are amplified by a decrease in fields of well-paying job opportunities, meaning many recent graduate, graduates are unemployed and continue to face massive student loan debt. So you're probably thinking, how can I take action with these rising university costs? One thing we can do as a student, students is to sign the petition against the change, changes to OSAP and get the word out on how these rising costs can affect us in the future. Something students can do to reduce their prices to personal, personally is to take online classes or look into businesses that, t that make it possible to attend school while still working for the company. If students do not look into ways to cut their costs, they will be leaving post-secondary school drowning in debt.